Hello everyone. Well, suppose a string A contains this S and B also have the same S, means both pointing out the same string address. Now, interesting part is if we change this B, then B will create a new storage and store new string in that, and A is still the same because we already know strings are immutable. Next, I have learned about reverse array function. Let's say if we put 10 and then we want to print reverse of this number till 1, then we can define a function using for loop, and this works perfectly well. Next is swap alternate function, and by using this function, we can swap elements with Each other. Let's define this function. We took input a list, and initially i is zero. And we say while i plus one is less than length of the L, means we want to go till end of the list. Then we assign li and li plus one to li plus one and li, means those both values assigned and replaced with each other. And then we have to go to the third element. So we increment the i value by two at the end. That is, if current i is two, then at the end it will set i is equal to three. Then third and fourth element will be swapped with each other, and this function works perfectly fine. 